Right, so we're doing the incline dumbbell bench press or chest press here. So this is a great one for building up strength and muscle, toning up all the muscles in the chest, the shoulders and the back of the arms. So really great for building up that pushing strength. So the first thing you want to notice here is the angle of the bench. So we have roughly 30 degrees here very similar to doing it at 45 or 60 degrees. You can play around with it and see what feels best for you. Along with that, you've got the angle of the actual seat itself. So you want the seat to be tilted up slightly and that just ensures you're not sliding off the bench itself. Then what you wanna do is pick up the dumbbells. So you wanna pick them up to the point where they're resting on your knees and then sit down for a second. From there, you're gonna use your knees to push the dumbbells up and get them into that starting position. Once you've reached that starting position, your feet are going to be flat on the floor, you're going to, your bum is going to be down on the bottom of that seat, you're going to have a slight arch in the lower back, and you're going to pinch your shoulder blades back together so you feel nice and steady on the bench. From there, what we want to do is press those dumbbells up overhead until you have straight arms, and you don't need to touch the dumbbells at the top, just to the point where you have straight arms. When you're coming down, nice and slowly, elbows are coming out nice and wide, slight angle to the body, okay? And then you're keeping those dumbbells squeezed nice and, nice and tight throughout as well. So controlled movement, as low as is comfortable for you, that'll vary between people, but come down as low as is comfortable, press up to those straight arm position, and then the next thing you need to be concerned with is putting the dumbbells down again. So you don't want to just throw them down, you want to bring them down with control onto the knees again, and then place them back onto the floor or onto the rack if you're done with the exercise overall. So as a quick recap, great exercise for the chest, the shoulders, and the triceps, 